On September 13, 2021, a series of events was organized in Mias within the NGV rally agenda. The guests visited the assembly line of the Aveco AMT trucks. The company is ready to manufacture customer-tailored CNG and LNG vehicles and plans to commercialize them in the near future. The assembly line of the Ural plant produces several modifications of trucks running on compressed and liquefied natural gas. Ural plant is one of the main suppliers of special vehicles for oil, gas, and construction industries. The plant offers 20-plus modifications of special methane breathing vehicles. Mias trucks operate in off-road conditions and extremely low temperatures down to minus 65 degrees centigrade. Experts believe that in this class of machines, it is too early to consider electric options. Representatives of Ural, Aveco, Gazprom, Uniper, as well as the Russian NGV Association discussed key issues of the NGV business at a roundtable held in the corporate social center. Representatives of transport organizations shared their experience of operating Ural gas vehicles. Before the flag off, methane cars, buses, and multi-purpose heavy-duty vehicles were exhibited on the square. The rallyists were greeted by representatives of the region and city authorities, as well as plant top managers. At the end of the ceremony, the chairman of the Council of Veterans of the Gas Fuel Industry presented the honored Gazanat medals to the plant's NGV designers, engineers, specialists and drivers. The veteran car was the first to hit the rally route. Uniper's gas-fueled Passat has been participating in the Blue Corridor Rally since 2010. During this time, she ran 285,000 kilometers on methane and crossed Eurasia twice from ocean to ocean. An impressive variety of special-purpose vehicles on CNG and LNG were demonstrated by the Ural Automobile Plant.